The challenge of getting to SDG 6 is time and money and human capital. So my position is, if we as the water sector can be more influential and have our own way of leadership to influence top leaders, in this case presidents and ministers of finance, we can move faster towards SDG 6 because we can bring in new methods of financing and they have to be much more than just government funds. All kinds of private financing and bonds and taxes and concessions, everything together is required to get us to the level we need to be, which is about four times the investment of today. So my numbers were 40 billion to 175 billion a year we need to invest. And then as we get to SDG 6, it moves to the operational maintenance phase and tariffs become the primary source of funding. At the same time, we need more people in the water sector. We need more water professionals to keep the infrastructure running, to make sure the level of service stays high, make sure we have reliable service 24 seven and create new jobs for, because there will be new jobs because there will be so much more water infrastructure to keep running. And we need more water professionals in the countries that are still building up their infrastructure. So these can be engineers, they can be planners, they can be in finance, economists, they can be operators and maintenance workers, which will be the majority that we'll need because we're building a lot of infrastructure over the next uh, 15 years or so. And they can be people in technology who haven't been in the water sector before but can bring innovation and help us think differently to move faster. Water for People. We're a global organization. We work across nine countries, five in Latin America, three in Africa and India. And we work with over four million people right now. And what we call our impact model is everyone forever. So we take a district, and right now we're working in 32 districts. And we make a master plan over several years, five to 10 usually, to get service to everyone in the district. And everyone means every family, clinic, and school. But we want the service to last forever. So there's a large emphasis on creating the utilities to keep the systems running, helping develop the water professionals, in this case, that do the operation and maintenance, helping develop the right rates with the local community, the local municipality typically, and what the affordable, yet covers the cost of service. And then we can exit. Thank you.